back. We have not posted in about 10 days. So uh -huh. it's been longer than that, it feels like. To be honest. Nice. Yeah, we haven't posted in a long time. So we're getting back to you guys today. We had you guys tweet us some questions you guys wanted to ask us. So we're doing a Q&A about time because it's been a while since we've done a Q&A. A really long time. We've only done like two. So this is going to be our third. And guess what? Spring break is literally in two days. And we got a beach house with our friends. So this is going to be pretty wild. And you guys are going to stay tuned and follow our vlog channel because we're going to be vlogging it a lot. And that's at Kachi Twins Vlog. Can you guys do us a favor before we get into this video? Pause this video and go subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Even if you haven't watched the video yet, give it a thumbs up. Without further ado, let's just get into the video. First question is a little... Ooh. Oh, wow. Ever had a lesbian experience in any way? Oh. Yes. Yes, I have. Explain it. Okay, so... Let's hear this. Mine's not that serious, like, where it's like, ooh, I like girls, you know? It's more of like me and my friends were out and it's just like we were joking around, we kissed each other. Nothing big, nothing like, oh, we're in a room hooking up, seriously. It was just like a little. To be honest, it wouldn't be a lesbian experience because you still like guys, so it's a bisexual experience. I mean, I wouldn't say I'm, okay, you're going too much into it. I wouldn't say I'm a lesbian, but I am attracted to girls. Girls are hot. I find them attractive. I think every girl does, honestly, in my opinion. Yeah, to be honest, I feel like every girl has a little gay in them. Um, I have had lesbian or bi experiences. Mm, should I get into detail? No. Of course. Stay tuned. What? Stay tuned. I've heard about this before. Is this where you come out and tell me something? Have you ever sucked toes? I mean, I've never sucked a toe, but it was like jokingly wise, like, oh, I dare you to lick this toe. So I've licked a toe, not sucked a toe. Um, my older sister. <laughs> it sounds weird, but I did In a jacuzzi, toe. right? No. Oh. Okay, that must have been you. I, I definitely never sucked my sister in a jacuzzi. I mean, sucked my sister's toe in a jacuzzi. <laughs> no. So we were sitting on the couch, and I was on Snapchat. It was like a day around Snapchat. They're like, suck your sister's toe. I was like, ew, no. I was like, whatever. I'm going to do it just as a joke. So I want this, and I literally want this. Look, this is a toe. Ew. That's not sucking. What? I guess it sucked a little just bit. Just like me, though. You kind of like. I like. <laughs> Too hype for spring break. Look, I'm so much tanner than you. I'm about to get tanned for spring break. But anyways, next question. Have you? <laughs> Have you ever gone to a physical fight with someone? Yes. Yes, with her. Should we explain the story? Yeah, we're gonna tell you a little no, story let time. Let me tell it, cause she does not know how it went down. So first off. We were driving back from a party and the car was already packed. The car sits five people. So we already have eight people in the car. Legit. There is so much going on in this car. Don't get me even started. A lot. I'm already mad because I wanted to go home like like hours before. She's always a party pooper. Let me just say this first. And I get mad. That's why I'm out. When I'm out, I'm always getting mad and catching attitude because she's always like, can we go home? Can we do this? I'm like, okay, I'm having fun. You came, so you're going to have to wait till we all want to leave. All right. Anyways, it's already like so, a situation I do not want to be in. But we're in the car and she starts getting rowdy. And literally, I'm so hot and I'm already like annoyed. I'm like, stop, Mikkel. Stop, Mikkel. Please stop. And she's not even next to me. She's literally a person over. So she started elbowing me, like on purpose, like trying to make me mad, like mad on purpose. And I have me here too. I have a short temper and I have anger issues and I go like this. I was like, stop it right and now. Anyone touches me, I get anger problems too. So I like pushed her face against the window and I started like hitting her because I just had really bad anger problems that night. I started like swinging on her and hitting her back and forth. And she actually kept like sitting there because she couldn't move because I was holding her head bound and people punch, kept punching her. She was biting me in the face. I had bruises and she bit me in the arm. I had bruises. And guess what? She broke her tooth. Oh and my gosh. That's what's, that was the worst thing. That's what I regret. And I said, I apologize for her for like punching her and stuff because it's her little attitude problem. But I, the next day I was at school. Sorry, this just has to go with the story because it's funny. I was sitting there and I was eating a pizza and you guys her you guys tooth fell off. Let's just get to the point. Yeah. It fell out and I was While so she was eating, so embarrassed. Have you ever been with the same sex? If you mean like dating wise, no. But flirting and kiss, <laughs> yes, I have. Have I been with the same sex? Yes. Where do you guys want to live after you get out of school? Our plan in the beginning of the year was to move to LA. 
But we decided not to move to LA because they take so much taxis out. So we decided just to live here. We're gonna buy a house and then we're gonna invest on the house and just go like back and forth to LA. You know? Just get Airbnb. So it's easier that way. We're gonna take acting classes instead of school, but we'll probably have like a couple of credits at CSN. Yes. What's the most sexual thing you've ever said? Honestly, mm. I'm a freak. I'm like I'm a freak still. Freaky twins. Free the freaky freaky Friday. The freakiest thing I've ever said. I've said some freaky stuff, but that's YouTube appropriate. I'm just gonna say I say daddy a lot. Daddy? Hmm. I don't. Uh, I don't really know if uh, all mine's appropriate. I just say something that's the least appropriate. Mama. <laughs> Mommy, there we go. Yeah, I'm pretty dirty girl, so I'm not gonna get into it. All right, me. that's weird. Have you ever been confused with your sexuality? Um, no, no, I know, I know. So I'm straight, like, I straight up like boys. I know for a fact I like boys. What about you? Um, yes and no. I don't know. You have been, just yeah. be honest, you have been confused with your sexuality. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, positive. I like both, both for sure. Raindrops. All right, you get hyped every time I tell them so. Yeah, I know because they don't know this side of you. At what age did you guys have your first kiss and are you guys still virgins? First kiss was- Two questions in one. Whoa, 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 slow, slow it down. down. My first kiss was, I was in first grade? Yeah, first grade. Mine was, I don't remember, I would say seventh grade. I was like 10, I mean, didn't count. My first make out though, since they didn't ask that, my first make out was freshman year. My first makeout as well was freshman year, no, and it was, it was on the beach. Yeah, it was, was in eight. Oh yeah, it was, it was on the beach. I remember. It was on the beach, and we're on a pier, and he was older than me. He was 23, and I was like 16. I so remember the regret. Time. That is a regret. He was busted. He was. The next question you guys asked with that question: Are you a virgin? Yeah, I'm a virgin. She's still a virgin. I got my card right here. I'm not a virgin. Nope, I'm not a virgin. All right, next question. Are you awesome. sad? Do you regret it? Um, I don't regret it. I mean, it's something that I chose to do, you know? And I can't regret something that really was my choice, too. So. Would you ever date a girl? Yeah. Um, depending on the girl. I mean, I would date Kim Kardashian. I'd date Megan Fox. I'd date a Victoria's Secret model, but... I think I'd date... What's her name? She's so oh, bad. Just this. Relationships are pointless in high school, to be honest. Back straight, back straight there. If you could wake up tomorrow on somebody else's body, who would it be and what would you do? Um, I would definitely want Khloe Kardashians because her butt is so fat. It would just be so fun to twerk because I'm a twerkaholic. So I'm just like, boom, boom, boom. I'd be hyped. That's what about safe. you? That's safe. What about you? Hmm. Who's, who would I want to wake up to be? Um, I would want to be Steph Curry. <laughs> um, with them shots, boy. With them shots, boy. He has a perfect family and everything. And he just... Okay, we're talking about body, not family. And what? Oh, Steph Curry's body. Someone's body I would want to wake up in. Probably a Sports Illustrate model. Yeah, they have really good buff bodies. Buff, 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 buff bodies. Have you ever been in a life or death situation? Yes, we have. Yes. When I fractured my foot. Oh, thank God you got your time. I know, I, I was about to explain it. <laughs> no, when I fractured my foot, when we got to that ATV accident, when we flipped it, then on top of me, I was passed out. We're like, a, I think nerfing scar, guys, excuse me. And I was passed out for like a cool five minutes and she was like screaming and like trying to wake me up and all this stuff. It was horrible. But yeah, we've been on the life and death situation. Would you ever invite two of your fans to your 18th birthday party? Of Actually, course. Let me get to this one. That's an option. We have to get it approved first. So stay tuned for that. So two fans, if you guys want to come to our birthday party, comment down below. Have you ever talked mad shit about another YouTuber? No, honestly, my sister and I are so mutual with everyone, even if someone talks crap about us, unless- I'm forgiving people. Unless, yeah, honestly- Not you, I wouldn't say you actually. I'm forgiving, I just hold grudges, but I'm like, I'm gonna be straight up. I get mad, like if I see you in public and like you're not nice to me, I'm just gonna be giving you like a dirty look, like no, I don't mess with you. I don't really know any YouTubers to hate them, so yeah. So no, we don't talk crap about any YouTubers, we're pretty mutual. Even when we had like drama with other YouTubers, we didn't talk crap. Would your younger self be proud of what you became? Yes. Yes. I've always wanted to, like, if you guys go look this up, I need to find this. Oh, you guys will die this. at this. It's um, the Tween Tween Sis. Our old account, we always wanted to make YouTube videos and all this. Go check it out. It's called Tween Tween Sis, T-W-I-N-G, T-W-I-N-G-S-I-S. T-E-R. Sister, Tween Tween Sis. 
sis. No, it's twink twink sis. Oh. That was our old account. If you guys go check that out. It was so Look, we were trying to be like Miranda Sings. I know. Uh-huh. We love Miranda Sings. But yeah. What's the craziest thing you've ever done? Hmm. I've done a lot of crazy stuff. Local. Cliff jumping is pretty crazy if you ask me because I'm scared of heights. Twerked on stage at um, YG. YG's concert. That's pretty crazy. That's one thing I've done that's really crazy. And I got a lot of hate but love for that one. But I don't really care. I was just like, whatever. I wasn't going to stop in the whole concert and be like, no, I'm not twerking. That's so, it. I was like, whatever. When's the last time you made out with someone? Three weeks ago. Um, I was like... Three days ago? Three, days ago. <laughs> three weeks, three, three days. days. I don't remember. Three, three, three. I forgot. So that's the end of our QA video. I hope you guys did enjoy it and give it a thumbs up and subscribe and subscribe to our vlog channel. I said this in the beginning. Kachi Twins vlog, just to remind you guys. Comment down below if we should invite two subscribers to our birthday party, our 18th birthday party. And stay tuned to our vlogs. I swear, you guys will enjoy them because you guys are asking always, like, what's your daily life? Like, I want to see how you live. You're going to see spring break, how we live. Yes, this spring break coming up. Bye, guys. Bye.